Hi guys, um, today I'm just going to run through a, um, a very quick tutorial on um, setting up a, a web server using Ubuntu. Um, Ubuntu is really, really easy to use. Um, you can install it alongside Windows um, and it's, it's a great place to start if you're, if you're new to Linux. Um, I'm using 12.10 uh, which I think is the latest version. Um, and you can uh, grab that from ubuntu.com um, so in order I'm going to just run you through installing Apache, PHP, MySQL and PHP MyAdmin um, and that should be enough to um, to get you going okay so to start with we're going to install Apache um, and to do that we're going to want to open up a, a terminal window and you can do that by pressing Control, Alt and T you can see here my terminal window. So in there I'm going to type sudo apt-get install apache2. It's going to ask me for my password. So I'm going to type that in and hit enter. Uh, now it's going to ask me if I'm happy with uh, this extra space being used. So yes. I'm going to let that run for a bit. And actually, whilst that's running, I'm going to open up a browser window. So we can make sure that that installed OK. OK, so I'm just going to go to localhost. And you can see the default screen here telling me that it works, uh, which is great. So we know that Apache is installed OK. Now I'm going to move on to installing PHP. So again, in the terminal window, I'm going to type sudo apt-get install php5 lib apache2 mod php5. And I'm going to hit enter. <coughs> Again, it's going to ask me if I'm happy with extra space being used. So I'm just going to hit yes um, and let that work. <clears throat> I might just pause this whilst this is downloading. Great, so that downloaded and installed. Um, now I'm going to test uh, that, that that actually worked as it, sh as it should. So I'm going to create a file by going sudo get it var www and then we'll create a file called php info .php. Okay. And this has opened a blank file which I am going to just write uh, echo php info I'm going to save that and I'm going to close that now I'm going to go back to my browser I've got localhost here I'm going to go forward slash php info dot php and we can see that php has installed and this is just showing the extensions that are enabled so that's great, that's installed fine. Okay, so next stop is MySQL. So let's go ahead and install that. And that again is done using the terminal. And I'm going to type sudo apt get install MySQL server. Okay. Do I want to continue again? Yes. Again, I'm going to pause this just while this uh, installs. Okay, this is uh, this is now asking for a uh, root password. Um, I would recommend just creating a, a root password. Uh, it makes it more secure. Um, so I'm just going to create a password there. There we go. And 
we'll just let this continue. Sweet, now that's, uh, that's all configured. Um, now as a final step, we're going to install phpMyAdmin, um, which again, same terminal window, sudo apt get install phpMyAdmin. Uh, yes. Uh, now it's going to ask uh, which web server should be configured to run phpMyAdmin um, and we want Apache 2 so make sure that's selected and hit enter. And this will just finish configuring. Uh, okay, this is going to ask um, if it should be um, configured with a database, a default database. Um, you can select no if you know what you're doing, um, but I'm going to hit yes. Um, now it's going to ask for the password of the database administrative administrative user. So I'm just going to type in my root password again cool okay now the final step is uh, we need to copy a configuration file so you need to type sudo cp for copy etc slash php my admin forward slash apache dot Conf, and then we want to copy that to etc apache2 conf.d hit enter okay and we should just restart apache to make sure the changes are pushed through so sudo etc init.d Apache 2 space restart. Great, so now let's go back into our browser and go localhost forward slash php my admin. And there we go. Um, so all the steps for this tutorial are um, on the blog and there'll be a link below. Um, but that's basically it. It is really easy. Um, if you have any problems, just drop a comment. Cheers, guys.